Hello and welcome to another episode of Building This City. This is Soap the Great here. In the last episode we started this fishing hut. Um, and I put in the a bit of the floor and I told you that I was going with mostly oak wood and then I started putting down this spruce wood or this dark wood and well I, I just love this color. It's great. Um, so I switched it around. The dark wood is on the outside. That's going to be one of the design considerations here. And if you look there, there's a, a bottom detail, um, and that goes for the building part. You know, as I look at this, it looks a little bit more than a fishing hut, but that's beside the point. Um, I think I failed to mention in the last episode where I got this idea from. Um, I found some traditional fishing huts from Macedonia, oddly enough, and it's based loosely on that. They don't tend to have windows. Um, they tend to be very small, up on stilts, in the middle of a lake, and you can only reach them by boat. Uh, and this one, obviously, you'll be able to reach it by a pier that comes down that hill and uh, anyway so right now I am finishing up some of the inside or the really the framing and I'm getting ready to work on the roof um, and that is going to be interesting to say the least um, I want to do stone because it doesn't have the issue of burning fail. Let's go back in here. And get back up here. Okay, so not what I wanted there. Okay. This one, uh, the last episode ran about 20 minutes. This is it's a little bit long. This one I'm going to try and keep it around 15. We'll see how this works. And I'm out. Wow, that goes by pretty quick. So let's make us up some more. I'm getting some major lag on the server right now. I don't know why. And there we go, okay. Now, I need that moved up by one, or by one half. I wonder if that's even possible. You know what? There we go. Sweet. Quite what I was looking for there. That okay, that's good, that's good. And uh, we'll go here. Not the music is too loud. There we go. I hope that uh, that was not problematic for you. think. Hip roof, gable roof. Let's try the hip roof for now. And that is where you've got these layers that all go up, form kind of a pyramid shape. Ah, hate it when that happens. up okay and we're gonna keep going around 
You know, I could just use the shift key a little bit better. Yeah, so we've got this all wood structure and um, we do get rain and storms frequently. Um, so I don't want the lightning hitting this, so putting a stone roof on to minimize potential fire damage. We'll see if it actually works out, okay? For now, we'll just keep going around. I will probably have to make some more of these half slabs. But, the, okay, so, you know, most roofs, um, if you've been around Minecraft for a while, you've seen a lot of different roof types. Um, they usually involve stairs, uh, some mixture of that. It gives you a pretty steep roof line, and I'm not, I'm not a big fan of that for this build. Um, it just doesn't seem to to fit and based on the picture of of that fishing hut I was telling you about yep there we go it uh, didn't fit at all so I wanted more shallow more shallow roof line Let's see if we can get it there okay you know what We'll just go all out on that, and we'll get back up here. Dirt tower. Okay. So now, we keep going around. You see it here, folks. I'm just going to leave that. Hey, hey, it went in. Okay. Uh, I get it. Depending on how you put those, when you when you do that, it will either give you a whole block and you have to take down the whole thing, or it will give you just the two by themselves. Now, there we go. See how much lag that is? It's crazy. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Looks like a smiley face. Ugh. Nope. That's gotta go. It needs an overhang. Yeah, that's going to take a little bit of doing. Uh, hmm. Not a fan of that. Okay. See, this is why it probably would have been good to try in creative first. So, how about from this angle? See these random cows out here? Well, that doesn't look too bad from that angle, but no, it's uh, that roof's got to change. But I'll take care of that off camera. Um, it's at least got a roof for the time being. The next thing that we need is, you know, you go to the beach, sometimes you see you see piers. They've got the the fishing available. Um, but you also get little marinas. Or you can rent a boat, or if you've got a boat, you can easily just let it out right there. I want to do the same thing. 
I want this to be dual purpose. See if it actually takes. Is it going to take? Yeah, I don't know what's been up with the server. Something's going on. Let's, let's see. So I'm going to have a dispenser that shoots out boats off to the side here. It's going to be at the water level. So we'll go right here. So we're going to come down from here down to water level and we'll set out the dispenser and you can push a button, get a boat, go on a little journey, come back, land and then come back up into the fishing hut. Nice little area for loading and unloading. A little bit easier than we've had before. We used to have that, that canal right there served as a moat in the early days of th this little compound. Um, but it was not actually that useful. Um, you could get out um, and half destroy your boat on the way out, but you could not get back easily. Welcome to my creative world. Um, as I said, sometimes it helps to work things out in creative, and uh, I should have done that with the roof ahead of time, but I don't know, I guess we see things in, in, uh, in practice or in their final configuration before, and uh, it's not too bad to move things around, but anyway, this is a rough draft that I set up of the fishing hut. Um, I did not go with this design. It's a little too resource intensive, and uh, the, just the dimensions didn't seem right, so um, I had not put a roof on it. And then um, after that debacle in uh, in the multiplayer um, survival world, um, I decided to come in here and finish off the roof. So here's what I did. Um, you see I'm using wood in this one. It's just because it was on the hot bar. Um, we don't have that available. Well, I could do it in the survival world, but it's a little harder to get rid of rainstorms in survival when you don't have server commands available. Here I just do toggle downfall and we're done. Um, one thing I played with was putting stairs here. It looks really great. I like that a lot. But there are no stone stairs like that. And there's the cobble and stone brick stairs but no smooth stone stairs. So um, I can fool myself and think that Moyang is watching this and if they are that would be a nice addition but anyway so instead of the hip roof uh, this is a gable um, it does an overhang of one which I like that uh, it doesn't abruptly cut off um, and I guess I'm just used to that because that's what most houses I've seen are like um, and then I've started playing with another potential design um, here and I, I don't think this one's gonna work out so much because of um, well it just um, it's a little busy and the it seems to work better for a square roof um, instead of a rectangular roof like we've got we've got the two sections by um, by three, I believe. Um, so the dimensions would just be off. It's better if it would be square, or if I started the the uh, multi angles a little further in on the long side, and then it wouldn't be so drastic. Um, but anyway, I was just I've been thinking about this, and uh, I decided to try it out and see what could come of it. And it looks pretty nice, but. I just don't think in this build that it will work for us. Um, and I see... Is that what I want there? Now I'm going to come back and work on this later. Um, it's not germane to our discussion currently. So um, anyway, back to the survival fishing hut. Alright folks, after a little bit of in real life sleep, 
uh, some more thinking about it. I got rid of the hip design. I put a little lip on the side here. That looks a bit better. So that's what we're going to go with. Now, I need to figure out what to do in the middle. And then I'm going to build the little boat dock. After that, I will come back and show you the progress. Right, folks, uh, this is the uh, probably final walkthrough. Um, we'll see it again a little later, but uh, I still don't know what to do with that. I might leave it open just to give it an airy feel. And uh, we'll go in here, places to sit down. I'm going to put fishing rods in here, a carpet with some hidden light underneath. You just fish out here. If you want to cook up the fish, you can come in here and leave a little bit of coal for people. Come on down. Hit this, get a boat, and just the way the boats are now, it's not not as fun. But uh, that's part of progress, I guess. Well, that was not it. Um, I was thinking about this. Um, actually, most of a day has passed, and I was thinking about this after I recorded this morning, um, and. Uh, Check this out. You you know what? It's not going to work right now. There's not a boat in there. Watch this. You see that? Okay. You see how close that boat is to the wall? That is actually a bug, I've come to find out. It's um, currently uh, affecting 1.6.2. Um, and the boat seems to just stick right along with the dispenser, or in this case, right above the dispenser. But if you try and get in, you see this? It's just not moving until it breaks free a little bit. But when you do that, it uh, messes with the the uh, momentum a little bit. And there your boat breaks. Nice. So uh, anyway, that is currently a bug. And what it means is that this design is not going to work. So you know what we're going to do? We are going to take apart the dispenser and button combo and uh, we're just going to have a regular dock. So here we go. Uh, that won't actually be too bad. Take this down. Um, gather up all the resources. I'm not going to collect them all on screen. I'm just going to tear this out and we will just make something something small where you can just get out grab your boat. Actually I wanted that one. Um, let me keep that Keep this area. This should be fine. But uh, you've got to go. You're dead to me. Actually, I am going to do it on camera. So it shouldn't take too long. Pick up my stuff. And, uh, yeah, so... Uh, it's fun when, you, uh, when you're finding out little things. And... Uh, and there we go. So let's just replace that little little block here. And then um, where's the oak wood? There we go. Got that. And stone brick slabs. Those are on the hot bar. Imagine that. And um, well, I'm going to have to fix that. It's off slightly. Alright, well, let's try this.
I would ride off in the sunset, but it is midday. That is it for now, folks. Uh, really, truly, we're at almost 20 minutes. Uh, that's a little bit long for my tastes. Maybe you enjoy that. If you do, or if you enjoyed this little project, feel free to give a like. I would love to uh, hear your comments about it. If you want to see more, subscribe. And um, anyway, I will see you next time. Bye-bye.